So the album I'm reviewing today is John Fulbright's From the Ground Up. I absolutely love this album. Now this was his first official album. He had a live album before that, but this is his first official album and it's absolutely his best. This is just an un This is just an unbelievable album with really strong songs, not only lyrically, but musically, it's just fantastic. And for me, it was easily the best album of 2014, no question about it. So for those of you who don't know who John Fulbright is, you should definitely check him out. Basically, he's a, he's a young guy from Oklahoma, and he sings uh, what I call kind of more folk music, but you know, that's a really tough thing to try to define this kind of stuff. But it's kind of like a southern blues folk type of music, and it's just incredible. It really kind of transcends multiple genres, and it kind of is really its own music, in my opinion. Now, it's hard to define what the best thing that Fulbright does, but in my opinion, most likely you're gonna go ahead and go with the vocals. His vocals are incredible. I was actually fortunate enough to see him at concert a few years ago, and it blew me away. I mean, his vocals are just incredible. There's so much going on with every single word. He sounds like someone much, much older and, and much more experienced. There's so much range in his vocals. Now, From the Ground Up also has some really great instrumentals, fantastic piano tracks, as well as harmonica, guitar, all over the place. Really great instrumentals. Now, there's a lot of standout songs on this album, a lot of songs that I really enjoyed. Now, probably the biggest standout is going to be Jericho. This song is mind-blowingly good. First time I heard this, I just could not believe that it was coming out in this day and age where most music just does not have that type of grit and soul and, and it's just got that deep, rich sound to it. What an amazing song. And then you have these really raw, kind of harder songs like God Above or Satan and St. Paul. These are just these rich, kind of raw type of songs that you just got to listen to. Once you, I think once you hear Satan and St. Paul, you will absolutely be hooked on John Forbright. The melody alone in Satan and St. Paul will just hook you right away. And then you have these really soft, beautiful ballads like I Only Pray at Night and Nowhere to Be Found. These are beautiful songs that you just got to listen to. So that's the thing that's so great about From the Ground Up is that you've got these really beautiful, soft tracks, these amazing kind of songs almost full of anger and and just frustration and it's just all plays together so well and to make this kind of perfect beautiful album and on top of that amazing variety you've got this these incredible melodies with every single song and these great great hooks in some of these songs and with all of that you get this amazing vocalist so it's a really great combination his his last album wasn't quite as good as from the ground up so i hope his next album kind of lives up to the hype I hope that he comes back strong with a really solid, amazing album again. I cannot recommend this one enough. From the ground up, from John Fulbright, I give this a 5 out of 5. Again, easily my best album of 2014. Definitely, definitely check it out. And if you like it, his other album, his last album, wasn't a bad album. It just wasn't that great either, right? So definitely check that one out as well. And then you can also get his live album that came out before From the Ground Up, and that's got a couple really good tracks on it as well, including an amazing, amazing rendition of Hallelujah from uh, Leonard Cohen. So definitely check that out. Check out John Fulbright if you haven't. Definitely let me know what you guys think of From the Ground Up. If you like the album, what your favorite song is, I always want to hear from you. If you like the video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys at the next Culture Critic.